Majestic Cool here, and welcome to another episode of Coolcraft Season 5. Now, in the last episode, we built this giant crane here as well as this iron farm, which I've built for the last three seasons. I didn't mention it in the last episode, of this, but I believe this was originally designed by Numbomb, you know, the guy who's now a developer of Minecraft. Anyhow, this thing has been hard at work since then, pumping out a lot of iron. And in fact, oh yeah, it's, hard. it's also the storage is still quite full after draining once. Also last episode, we started to prepare for what we're doing this episode, which is we are going to be building a wither rose farm, which will be necessary for stuff that comes later. But yeah, you know, that means we're going to need to go to the end, and um, of course, then that's the, something that we can definitely do. Now, before we get into it, I just want to complain about something right now. OBS just got a major update which broke compatibility with all, or at least as far as I can tell, all existing plugins, which means that the Stream Deck no longer works with its OBS integration, which ugh, it's so annoying because, like, ah, now I have to go click the stop recording button and, like, ah. Additionally, they've changed like the spacing of their buttons and stuff. So like all the control buttons for like stop recording, start streaming and stuff, they, they're so much taller now and you can't like compress them down. So the actual preview takes up significantly less of the window. Anyhow, now that I've done ranting, let's actually get into today's episode's content. All of my gripes about OBS, about the update to OBS have actually been solved by now. Um, Elgato released on their website at least, uh, a new updated version of the plugin for the Stream Deck and uh, there you can actually change the theme back to just dark, which is the original theme or the theme that was and the buttons are now smaller there. That's good, but um, just coming down here and uh, this guy decided to stop right there for some reason. Is there a chunk border there? No, there's not. Why did he stop right there? <laughs> um, but he did that when the storage down there was full anyway, so that's fine. To the end. Now, obviously, we have to find a appropriate or suitable end gateway portal to build this at here in the end, and clearly we don't want to use this one. So, I believe, uh, there's one that way. Yeah. There she is. There's an end gateway portal that I can use. Oh, right. It is actually quite precariously placed. But this will certainly do. So, um, yeah, step one, I guess, is actually remove the gateway itself. And, oh, well, that was considerably easier and more painless than I was expecting, but yeah. All right, now we have a basic wither cage. Let's, uh, I don't know, I'll put, a, I guess I'll go into, we'll go into a time lapse here. Yeah, let's do that. Woo! has been completed here and uh, it, the, the platform is much smaller than the previous seasons because I felt like well I'm only gonna AFK here like once or twice and I don't really need all that much drops so we don't need to have it all that big anyhow I did AFK here for a little while not like overnight or anything but I did get more than enough with the roses and to an extent ender pearls for what I'm going to be doing well, even just that chest is more than enough in the next episode. All right, so we've basically done what I planned for this episode already, and this is, at least as I'm currently thinking, not that far into the episode. So 
let's just prepare for next episode then, because that'll be very useful. So, just, ooh, uh, that's probably nothing good, alright. So, to start out with, we're going to need a large amount of wool, which means let's, well, we're building a simple automated wool farm, so yeah. Got a dispenser, got some observers, and yeah, then just gotta track down some sheep and stuff. Alright, this <laughs> little sheep farm here is complete. There are three sheep uh, crammed in there, so uh, yeah, good luck to you sheep. And um, oh, I just realized I could do a bit more to optimize this uh, grass spreading. So actually, I'm gonna do that quickly, but yeah, this sheep farm, basically it's finished. Alright, so Jared Eagle has opened a wood shop, and I'm gonna need to buy a lot of wood next episode, so I'm going to upgrade the tunnel bore we have here for mining to be wider so I can get the more diamonds that I'm gonna need to pay for all that wood. Alright, the expansion has completed. Ah, I forgot a piston. I was one piston short and I went back to my base, but I did not, in fact, bring back a piston. So anyhow, uh, yeah, I guess uh, I gotta get another piston. Alright, after driving it forwards for a while, I got one stack and four diamond ore plus nine diamonds that got blown up by the machine. And as you can see, we have driven forwards quite a ways. So yeah, um, hopefully this is going to be enough to fortune up in the next episode and buy enough wood. Assuming Jared Cool actually stocks that much wood, that is. Alright, it's been a hot second, and uh, yeah, I got presumably enough diamonds. I haven't fortuned them or anything, but I'll do that later. I also have waited enough time to collect enough wool here, so I'm going to start taking this and loading it into the shulker box over here. Yep, just uh, making some carpet here. Alright, so during time, I have done a bit of work here in the nether. Create someone stole my boat. Uh, but to create a transport system here, which is oh yeah, it's probably just Tyler. Um, to create a transport network between all the current key locations in well beneath the Nether roof. So naturally, at this end of the system, we have my base. If we travel up here and over a little bit, we get Tyler's base. Uh, obviously, go down this way a little ways, and on this side, we get to Jared E. Co we get to Jared E. Cool's base, which is right there. And then back here off this way, we have the end portal right down here. Although once you go through that portal, you do have to drop down a ladder, but eh, that's not my problem. <laughs> eventually, if you go down the path past the past Jared E. Cool's portal, you get eventually to spawn, which is this portal here. But if you go past that and keep going, you'll end up at the desert slash mesa biome portal. All this <laughs> serves to make a much more convenient transport system than the one that we had, which was just like bridges over open nether that may have had mobs on them and were stupid long. This is so much easier. No mobs. Very fast. Very easy. All right, quick update on the uh, situation for all my supplies for <laughs> the shulker horizon. For all my supplies for next episode, they are all piled up here, apart from the with the roses. Apparently, uh, don't worry, I'll get that eventually. Also, a quick update on the iron farm, which, as you can see, has expanded its uh, storage a lot since the beginning of the episode. Uh, that that chest is a little empty, but. Uh, yeah, uh, this basically filled up, okay, it didn't fill up all these chests, but it filled up a lot of them, and I didn't want to have to keep emptying it, so, oh, that was my last firework. Oh, well, um, so yeah, I actually made a proper off switch, so yeah. I mean, I probably won't need a lot of iron for a while, but in the case that I do, you know, iron farm is right here. Oh, you know something else that may help with the financial situation for the next episode is uh, collecting profits from my shop, which has brought in 18 diamonds so far, and uh, that's about it. But I'm sure people will continue to need slime in the future. Also, if the audio is changing, it's because of, well, well, see, audio is slightly different. It's because of, well, I just feel like talking at different volumes, apparently. But also, the mic is significantly close to my face, so actual big changes in my actual speaking, I guess, are more noticeable now. 
Alright, the video should now be over 10 minutes long, which means I'm comfortable ending it, so I'm gonna have to say thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Check out my game, which I may be producing an update on in the next year or so. <laughs> Linked in the description, and I will see you all in the next episode of Coolcraft Season 5. Bye!